Hi there, in this video we'll take a look at all the new improvements in Chitavalp 5 Beta 115. The first improvement is add an action to release the ladder for Platforma object. Yes, there is a new action in Chitavalp. To make use of this action, you can find it in your events, add action and select a an object with the platformer object behavior so play hit box and you can search this by going to release and there we have it so simulate to release ladder key press and that's the new action there we go so, so simulate a press of the release ladder key used to get off the ladder so the next improvement is improve actions and condition search allowing typing mistakes and you can try this out by going into events and let's add an action and let's type LLL and you can see we have this um, action still displayed. If this was JDevelop 5 Beta 114, there would be no more actions available and we can try this out. I'll just get JDevelop 5 Beta 114. This is it. So add an action and LLL. So there you go. That's the new improvement in JDevelop 5 Beta 115. So the next improvement is show previews of image resources properly pixelated when smoothening the when smoothening is deactivated. You can find this in the project manager and resources and here we go. Select the resource and this is the new improvement which would show the preview of the image resources properly. So if you enjoyed the tutorial please like, subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss future uploads like this. The next improvement is show pixel ads assets in the asset store as pixelated and larger. So let's go ahead into our asset store. You can do that by right clicking insert a new object and search asset store. So you can see already see this pixel ads right here. They've made them larger so you can see them more easily and they've also been pixelated as you can see on the screen right now. So that's the improvement. The next improvement is add an action to clear the shapes of a shape painter object on demand. You can find this um, new action by adding in a new object and I'll select shape painter. Apply this, head into your new scene event, add an action and um, you can say clear shapes. So there you go, that's the new action in JDevelop 5 Beta 115 which should allow you to clear the shapes of the shape painter object whenever you want. The next improvement is add an action to forbid to jump again while in the air to the platformer behavior. You can find this by going to new scene events and add an action and select an object which has the platformer behavior attached to it which is platformer um, play hits box right here. So select this and this is the new action called forbid jumping again in the air. This is useful if you want to allow to jump again in the air for a bit of time and then forbid to jump again later. So that's another new action to the platformer behavior. Okay and the final improvement for JDevelop 5 Beta 115 is add thumbnails in the resources list. You can take a look at this by going to your project manager and resources. And so you can see these thumbnails right here which are displayed with the resources. And you can also compare this with JDevelop 5 Beta 114. Um, here we go. Here we have this without the thumbnails and we just have the names. And in JDevelop 5 Beta 115 we have the thumbnails and the names. So that's the last improvement in this version. There's one thing I noticed which wasn't actually documented and that's the increase in the size of the events sheets editor and you can see this in events and when I add an action you can see the size of this which is much larger than what we have it had in JDevelop 5 Beta 114 and you can compare this let's um take a look at JDevelop 5 Beta 114 add um let's events tab and add an action and you can see the size here if i head to jdevelop 5 better 115 you can also see the size and yes that's what i noticed and it's a really nice feature if you want to read the bug fixes and internal changes i'll leave a link in the description so you can check that out and yes and also let me know what you think about this version in the comment section below thanks for watching i'll see you in my next video